Okay, this is for Bill, because he is so curious. Take a good look here. Here's the skis. I think they've been modified with these tips, although I can't say for sure. There was some oak left, but it's pretty much gone. <clears throat> they still turn. The steering wheel still turns, not seized. Now underneath here, there's the pulley system. I don't know if I'm getting a shot of that or not. The head over there, and that's where the steering happens. There's the big drive cog. Now, the, my book says it is supposed to be covered in rubber. And then also there's the grocery bars, giant pillows, the bearings. Then there's these aluminum wheels with tires on it. Leaf spring suspension. Okay. I come up to the back, you can see that's where a battery was mounted. I don't know if that's where it was actually originally put. And then the rest was covered in plywood. There's the seat, or what's left of it, and there's a few pieces of it in there. Here you can see Get up inside here and take another look. Here's your controls. Get your ammeter. I think this was the, your lights. There's your starter button, key. I don't know why you need a key, but this is a three speed Model A transmission. And down inside here is your throttle. Here's your clutch. I think that is a Rockwell or Rockford. I don't remember what the brand is. But. And your pulleys. And then there's the engine. There's the Wisconsin. There's the windshield. That's got to be 5 16 polycarbonate or a plexiglass. And if we come to the front, there's the headlights. And if we open this up, now inside there is the Wisconsin twin cylinder. It has an electric start and a generator and a hand crank as well. There's the hand crank. Uh, it's seized, so it's been pumped full of oil, and it's going to have to be pulled out and completely rebuilt. But uh, I ran the number on the ID tag, and it, <clears throat> the year of this engine fits with the year of the sled, so I assume that's still the original engine. There's your primer right there, carburetor, distributor, there's the clutch over there. I, this, I don't, this must be the generator. On the other side is the starter, I think. I may have that backwards. <clears throat> and then all the sheet metal, you can see inside is an entire framework that he made. And then he skinned it with sheet metal. He cut it and folded it around and then screwed it on. See the screws. It's all covered in screws. So you could easily replace everything on here. And you can see a little bit left on the oak and the hole in the side there. And then there's your drive system with the chains. And that's it. That's the whole shittery. I can't imagine how with that that gas pedal down there and you sitting here, how you're gonna see through this windshield. It's this thing is so tall. It's ridiculous.